to raid all in the wild. Even, not better, but cooler. Not even cooler. But there's a Jin too. There's a Wonder Woman and a Batgirl. Another Wonder Woman. <laughs> things off the shelf because I'm talented that way. And a supergirl. Okay, I just knocked everything over. Good job me. There we go. Supposedly there is a Harley Quinn in the world too. I haven't seen her yet though. So this is how we're going to do the vlog today, evidently. Today is Vlogmas Day 10. Vlogmas Day 9 went up very early this morning. I was super tired last night and didn't get my editing done. And today, I have a phenomenally horrific headache that it wants to be a migraine. It might actually be a migraine. Actually, considering how many drugs I've taken, it's a migraine. I just don't like calling it a migraine. And for those of you who are new to the thing, hi, it me, Tree, and this gloriousness is Mr. Morph, Morph the Magnificent. He is 18 pounds of pure tabby fury, and he is very unhappy with me today for some reason. Mostly I think it's because it's supposed to snow, and somebody hates the snow. And that sound in the background is gnome chopping vegetables for dinner, because gnomes are cool that way. Yeah, so this is how this is going to be. You see me? shot at what I see. I see two little people. Hello. You're very cute. <laughs> Would love to draw you sometime. And I see this. Strangely for having had a migraine for most of the day, I've gotten stuff done. We went to the grocer and I made a creepy shadow monster painting and I did some some did some thing, what's that called, drawing, I did some, some, it's not even drawing, it, it's, it's doodling, it's stuff to knock me loose, I, I'm, <sighs> brain isn't working, let me explain the thing, other than the fact that migraine, I have a con coming up next weekend. And it, it, it should be rather substantial. And we are up in the air about whether or not I'm going to get to go. Because Gnome's job has decided all of a sudden out of nowhere that they're going to have mandatory like grant writing workshops Thursday and Friday this week. We don't actually, let me correct that, we don't know if they're mandatory yet. That's what we're waiting to hear about. Which, if that's true, that means I can't do the con because I can't do the con by myself. I can do the con by myself, I guess, but it would be, end really badly if I did it myself. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I just need to, you know, do it myself. I don't know. The reason why it's difficult for me to do it myself is that I have chronic pain issues, and anyone who remotely has chronic pain issues understands that there are only so many things in a day that you can do. And that varies widely on the day. Like yesterday I had about three things in me. Today I have a, I've had about six so far. And there's at least three more spoons that I can use. Maybe four. I, I think I have editing and 
I have the comic in me yet today. And the, the cat being on my shoulder. Trying to do something like a con by yourself when you have chronic pain issues and I have a myriad of other issues, including the migraines. So it's very, very, very difficult to do these things on my own. Because there's, it's in Rosemont. So there's like, you know, five, six, seven hours of driving. There's the setup, which always involves a schlep from the outer edges of the universe. Just to get the stuff to the table. Then there's the actual setup, which since Grig Rack is both miraculous and of the devil, it's always a crapshoot whether or not my hands will do it, because my hands are craptastic and suck and are arthritic. The joys in having been an artist my entire life. And then there's doing all the con stuff and the getting to and from the con and then the breaking down and then the schlepping everything back to the car and then the driving back. So it really makes life easier if there's a second person. So th this, this is what I'm contending with and I I'm kind of mad and it's, it's not remotely Gnome's fault. Gnome is actually very angry too, so you know, we, we are a household full of very, very mad small people. Because we are very small people. Alright, that's enough complaining. I have things to do and a cat to convince to get off my shoulder. I will be back tomorrow with a video. Theoretically, unless my head explodes between now and then, which I wouldn't put it past at this point. Okay, courage. <laughs>